Hi guys, what I'm going to show you today is how to hide and unhide your desktop icons on a Mac easily. Now the way this is done, we use a program called Automator to make a little script which uh, we it puts in the services menu in Finder. And as you can see there, we got two options to hide and unhide. As you can see on my desktop, I already have icons on there. So this will hide them, as you can see, they're gone. And we got one which will unhide them. Uh, this comes in very handy if you do work like mine and you save a lot of things to your desktop simply because you're too lazy to organize them into folders and stuff. So what you have to do, you have to open a program called Automator, which is in your applications. Okay, so we open up Automator and what we get with the face of a, a menu here, we can choose for different things we can make. We want to make a service. It's hard to explain, but you want no input and you want Finder. Basically what this does is when something happens in Finder then whatever action you put in here will occur. But what we're going to do is we're going to search for run Apple script because that's what we want it to do. We're going to write a little Apple script. We drag it in there and now we're going to write a little Apple script. Okay. Now delete all this. I like to start again. So on run do shell script um, c comma c no not comma what are they called speech mark thing ch flags space hidden squiggly line which is on the right on left hand side of your keyboard forward slash desktop forward slash asterisk then close that up again and then end run and basically what that will do that will hide the desktop icons so what we're gonna do there we're gonna click file save and you're gonna type that as high desktop icons or whatever you want to call it and then that will appear up in here as you can see it's there's an untitled now because I didn't save it as the name and then we just want to make another one so you can erase this again uh, well, you don't even have to erase it. All you can do is just type in by here, no hidden, and then that will be the undo one. So you can save that as uh, unhide desktop icons, just like that. And then that's it. That's all you got to do. And from there on, you will have those in your, uh, in your menu up here. Okay. Uh, if you've got any problems, let me know. It should be pretty easy for you, but you never know. So, uh, yeah, goodbye.